What is cracking, everybody? Welcome back to Boo T V. Like, comment, subscribe. And let's get into the topic today. So I literally, literally just put out a video about Draymond Green's mom's tweet. And you know, towards the end of that video, I said, looks like the Warriors still haven't made a decision on if there will be a suspension or not. And I also said that um, if they do suspend him, it will only be due to the public pressure they feel from the media footage, from the video footage getting out to the public. And I, right after filming that video, I, you know, check my updates and looks like via NBA on ESPN update on Draymond Green per Kendra Andrews. The tweet says Draymond Green will rejoin the team on Thursday. Steve Kerr says he has been fined, but not suspended. Kerr says he will play in the team's final preseason game on Friday and will be available on opening night. Now, I know a lot of people are going to be upset about this, especially the Draymond Green haters out there, especially the people that really like to enforce this safe NBA, uh, safe haven NBA environment, you know, no violence, all that stuff. They all get it rightfully so, rightfully so, but... I actually, com I commend the Warriors for this. Not whether I agree on their decision or not. Um, do I care if he serves any games, if he misses any games or not? I don't. I'm not, no, I don't care. I mean, make your decision and move forward. But I commend them on their decision because I can appreciate anybody that doubles down and stands on their actions and do not react to the pressure of social media and the public. So while I really thought the Warriors were going to suspend him just on the pressure and how people would view, you know, if, if they, I was like, well, if they don't suspend him, they're going to be like, what type of precedence are you setting for your organization by not suspending this type of behavior? What type of, what type of, um, as as one of the better franchises in the in the league, you know this 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 shows poorly on the NBA as a whole that you would not suspend this kind of behavior. Good on you, Golden State Warriors. Good on you. Saying fuck this, this is our team. We're handling this in house how we want to handle this, and we don't feel like a suspension is necessary, so we are not going to suspend our player. And Twitter. Instagram, YouTube, social media, cuckolds, you all can eat a dick. Good, good, good on you, Warriors, for not succumbing to pressure. Good on you. I can, I can, oh, and I look at like, I look at just like other icons, other you know, media presences, um, Hollywood people, whatever the case may be, celebrities, and, you know, they do things that honestly aren't even that bad, and then Twitter and the social justice warriors and everybody wants to be in an uproar about it, and then they start backpedaling on what they said, I'm like, the hell with that, you ain't gotta do that shit, who the fuck are they? Say say the hell you want to say, and if you believe on it, stand on it. Right or wrong, stand on it. Unless you really, unless you really feel like what you did was wrong based on their response, and you feel that it is necessary to apologize and backpedal. But don't backpedal just because you're afraid of getting canceled, and you and you don't like the the controver the controversy coming your way. Stand on it. That's one. That's why Fifty Cent is like literally one of my most favorite people in the world. Fifty Cent. To this day, still says everything he wants to fucking say. 50 says everything he wants to say. Things that get people canceled all the time for the day. And not, and nothing has been shot. So you can't take 50 out. What you gonna do to 5th? 5th is gonna laugh at you. And then get petty. And then clown your ass. And everybody's gonna be behind them laughing. <laughs> You can't, you can't cancel because 50 don't believe. 50's like, 
Uh, if you honestly, it's one of those things, man. If, if you don't believe in it, don't give it any energy. Don't give, don't give it any energy. Don't just stand on stand on your actions, stand on your words, stand on your values, and don't don't breathe any life into it when it tries to come your way, and you'll be all right. Fifty says everything, bro. His his shit be cracking me up, man. Just 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 stand on it, man. You'll be all right. No, not everybody's gonna have your same opinion. You got a bunch of people that are trying to cancel everybody, but good on you, warriors. Like if it was me, like I said, I probably would have gave them. Well, I saw him giving like maybe 10, 15 games. But you know, five games would have been cool. Ten games would have been cool. Six games would have been cool. Eight games would have been cool. And zero games. I'm cool with that too. Whatever. I thought he would get at least a minimum of ten, fifteen. But good on them. Good on them. Good on them. Saying we handling this. You could like it or love it. I'm going to keep my player on the court and think nothing of it. Bars. B -b 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 Bars. <laughs> you could like it or love it. I'm going to keep my player on the court and think nothing of it, baby. Yes, sir. So, hey, I consider this a victory. Good victory for the Warriors organization. You're going to get Draymond on the court. They'll figure it out as men. Poole and Draymond have to deal with it, whether they reconcile or not. But life moves on, and basketball needs to be played. No suspension for Draymond Green. Let's get it popping. Dub Nation, go defend your throne. Good luck on your championship run. And I wish you nothing but the best. As I do a lot of teams. Let the season begin next week. Hoorah. Let me know what you guys think about it. Are you upset about this? Do you carry the way? Do you think he should have got some time served? How much time served do you think Draymond should have gotten? Let me know. I'm curious to hear your opinion. Like, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate you for watching. And I will catch you all on the next one. We out, baby.